Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Peachtree can record account beginning balances in any period for companies that have no posted transactions yet. After one or more transactions have been posted, Peachtree records beginning balances as prior period adjustments instead. To enter beginning balances for accounts, you must click the beginning balances arrow button within the maintain chart of accounts window if using a version of Peachtree prior to 2008. In Peachtree 2008 through 2011, simply click the account beginning balances button instead to open the same window. Next, select the period for which you want to enter or adjust the account balances. Then click the OK button. Now, usually, account beginning balances are entered in the period previous to the first period for which detailed transactions will be entered. The Chart of Accounts Beginning Balances window lists each account. Depending on the type of account, entries are entered into either the Assets and Expenses column or the Liabilities, Equity, and Income column. Peachtree indicates which column you should use by making the other column unavailable or grayed out. You then enter the beginning balances for your company into the appropriate accounts under the correct column. Ensure that you enter in all of the information necessary. If the trial balance, which is shown at the bottom of the Chart of Accounts Beginning Balances window, is not zero, then your books are out of balance. Now, if you click OK to set the balances when they're out of balance, an error message will appear telling you that if you click OK on the error message, that the difference will be posted to the beginning balance equity to keep your books in balance. This will allow you to enter and post transactions, but the amount will appear on general ledger reports and on the balance sheet until it's allocated to another account. Now a better idea would be to click the cancel button on the error message to return to the chart of accounts beginning balances window and then correct the accounting discrepancy. When the trial balance is zero, you can then click the OK button to continue. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.